This is a video demonstration of iliotibial band release for external snapping hip. We begin by visualizing the IT band on the left and the vastus lateralis fascia on the right. The IT band merges into the gluteus maximus insertion onto the linea aspera, and we identify the fibers of the IT band which run between the gluteus maximus and the gluteus maximus insertion. On the right again is the vastus lateralis fascia and beneath us is the gluteus maximus insertion on the linea aspera. And this insertion will be a part of the pathologic structure in a tight snapping IT band. So the technique for release will involve a cruciform cut in the IT band. First we'll perform a transverse incision in the IT band and this releases the longitudinal fibers. Part of the tightness of the IT band stems from these longitudinal fibers which run vertically along the leg. We're sure to cut sufficiently posteriorly that we address all of the longitudinal fibers of the IT band and here we discontinue the cut where the gluteus maximus muscular insertion begins. We'll then extend a longitudinal incision across the IT band crossing the gluteus maximus tendinous insertion which again is a part of the pathologic structure in a external snapping hip. This longitudinal cut takes tension off of the portion of the IT band that joins with the gluteus maximus tendinous insertion on the linea aspera and we complete this cut all the way distally anterior to that linea aspera insertion. That completes our iliotibial band release.